Hey, it's Pastor Dan from Dexter Gospel Church with our next Proverbs Practical. Thanks for listening today. Our previous video warned us to be careful what lessons we're learning. This one warns us about the behavior of the ungodly. We're in Proverbs 19, verse 28. Proverbs 19, 28 says, An ungodly witness scorneth judgment, and the mouth of the wicked devoureth iniquity. So an ungodly witness, the words there literally are a witness of Belial, someone devoted to worthlessness and wickedness. Well, what characterizes a person like that, someone that wicked? Well, it's that they despise justice. It says an ungodly witness, this witness of Belial, this person that will lead you astray, they scorn judgment. So they despise justice. They don't care about right and wrong, only what is expedient or what is best for them or what achieves the most for their cause. They victimize others and think nothing of it. They might even mock those who try to prevent people from being victimized. They might mock justice and doing what's right. That's the idea of scorning. They hold justice as unimportant. That's the idea behind despising and thus scorning something. Now, the first phrase speaks of their attitude toward right. The second phrase addresses their attitude toward wrong. It says, the mouth of the wicked devoureth iniquity. When it talks about devouring, it's not talking about just destroying it because they hate it. It's actually saying they appreciate it and enjoy it. They love it. They eat it up. Whether it's so that they can laugh at others who miss the mark, because there's some people who do that. They know they do things that are wrong. So instead of improving or changing their behavior, they look at other people and say, Aha! I found it. He did something wrong too. He's not so much better than me after all. Hey, don't you judge me until you fix everything in your life. So they take pleasure in the wickedness or the iniquity or the missing the mark of others so that they can justify their own wrongdoing. Others will enjoy wrongdoing because they're so far gone into wickedness that they just enjoy it for its own sake. They love things that God says that are wrong, whether they do them or whether it's other people that are doing them. They want to endorse them and support them and watch them and enjoy the fact that this wickedness, this missing the mark, this iniquity is being done. So, beware of those who speak without regard for justice, without thought for whom their words may hurt or whether they're true. Beware of those who care nothing for the plight or wrongful suffering of others. Don't let that be you. God sees speech and behavior like that, speech that scorns justice as ungodly, serving Belial rather than him. And beware too of those who take pleasure in wickedness. Don't let that be you either, whether it be the thrill of self-righteous comparison that some goody two-shoes isn't better than you after all, or whether it's an enjoyment of the sin for its own sake. I hope this video is a help to you. If so, give it a like and subscribe to our channel for more like it. We'd love to hear from you in the comments. We'd also love to see you at our church. Until next time, I hope you stay well, love justice, and hate iniquity.